Workplace drama is so stupid, y'all. I cannot deal with this. Like, I'm trying to get my mind right because of something that my manager approached me with this morning and it's just ongoing stupid drama like this is why i hate the nine to five job stuff so much because for whatever reason it doesn't matter what company you're at there's always drama and like petty stuff and nonsense and my peace of mind is worth so much more than this. It's worth so much more than this. So, I have an accommodation with our HR department because of my illness, saying that I can't work a regular five day work week of 50 plus hours like all the other employees do. And instead, I can work like a four day work week with less hours. I work full shifts, but the four day work week and the way it aligns keeps me right at about 40 hours, which is fantastic. I can do it. And it's tough a lot of days, but I get through it. I don't have a choice. And my manager decided to do some digging because he wants to take that away from me because he wants to schedule me on all kind of random days. Like I would probably wouldn't even get two consecutive days off if I went to five day work weeks and blah, blah, blah. And essentially came at me with, well, your accommodation expired. HR said it expired. I wish my disease expired. I wish my illness had an expiration date and just went away. I wish I just magically felt better overnight. I wish that I wasn't suffering every single day of my life and that things just went poof, you know? I wish, it, I wish there was really an expiration date on this so that I could be normal. But guess what? Even if y'all wanna say there's an expiration date to like whatever accommodation paperwork, I have not gotten better. Things are not like, I'm not magically a healed and fully functional robotic human being. I'm not. There is no expiration date to this and I wish there were. And not just for me, I wish anybody suffering with these issues, wish there was an expiration date so we could have a normal life back. It's just more work drama, more reasons why I hate working nine to five jobs or whatever you want to call them. It's okay. I'm just trying to get my mind right. I don't need to focus on this. I don't need to let it worry me. Things are going to work themselves out. I have a doctor's appointment next week. I'll get things taken care of, whatever they need, you know. It's just like, it shouldn't even have to come to this. Like, this is dumb. It's dumb. It's just more, like I said, more workplace drama. Like, peace of mind is like, <laughs> on the like uppermost level of the hierarchy of important things to me in my life. And I'm not gonna let y'all disrupt it. I'm not letting a job or letting anybody, any person, anything, like, I'm not letting y'all take this away from me. I need my peace of mind. It's worth everything. I cannot stress that enough. Peace of mind is so important. I just needed to vent. I'm sorry, you guys. It's really not that bad. I'm blessed. I am not letting this affect me. I'm trying not to let this affect me. I'm just getting it off my chest, shooting these words into the universe so that my mind is clear and I'm able to see these blessings and just 
do what I'm supposed to do. That's all I can do, and that's all we can shoot for. I just... It's so ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. But hey, it's nothing I can't overcome. It's nothing I won't overcome. It's not gonna steal... It's not gonna steal my joy and my peace from me. I'm, it's not. I'm good. I promise I'm good. I hope you're good too. You deserve it. I deserve it. We deserve peace and joy. And I will never stop saying that.